Tip number one is choosing a good name because this is going to start helping you brand yourself and around your community and also come up with a creative logo to go with your name that is also going to start helping you brand yourself because when you're driving around on the highway you want people to when they see your truck or trailer like we have this wrap I know when you first start you can't afford that but a, a magnetic sign or something you want them to be able to be like oh that's all that lawns in our case and coming up with a creative logo, it's all going to go together. Like we got the flower next to our All About Lawns. And just branding yourself so when uh, people in your community want a lawn care service, they just think of you just like that. Yes, tip number two is don't go out and buy equipment you cannot afford when you just started. We see this so many times in our community, a brand new lawn care service goes out and buys a 16 foot trailer, two mowers, they got $30,000 worth of debt and they don't even have but maybe two yards to mow. You've got to start small, go out and buy something you can afford. One mower, a small trailer and build yourself up. And then when you start building yourself up, go and get more equipment. We're going to touch on that in a later tip. Tip number three is do not hire someone until you absolutely have to. This happens all the time again in our community. And let me tell you, you can make around $75,000 a year solo mowing yards. And when you hire somebody and you only got $50,000 worth of work a year, that's just money coming out of your pocket. That shouldn't be. Tip four, use social media and Google because when you are a small business, you are on a limited budget and social media, Google, and other things that are free and you can advertise for free doesn't cost you anything. And get, get your customers to give you Google reviews. So when people get on there, they're more likely to call you. And just keep in mind to use things free to advertise when you are first starting because you have a limited budget. Tip number five is upgrading your equipment after you have built a customer base. This is the time where you go out and spend $10,000 on a mower. You go get you a new trailer, you wrap it, because now you have the jobs that you can afford it and you're not gonna go into debt like earlier when you first start and people do that. It's gonna save you on maintenance costs. Your product after you get done mowing a yard's gonna look better because you have a more expensive mower. When you pull up to the job site like we do with, you know, giving a bid with this trailer in our truck and you give the bid and the customer's walking around the yard with you, it just makes you stand out over other lawn care companies who are just pulling out up with a regular trailer and regular mowers. Tip six is probably the most obvious tip there is in this lawn care business. You have to be able to willing to be able, willing to work hard every day, day in and day out, and you have to be willing to do a quality job because word of mouth is one thing that's going to help you grow your business. So you don't want to pull up to a yard and do a bad job and you're doing three yards in that neighborhood and the neighborhood and then they tell the neighbor that you're doing or the neighbor sees it, you're going to lose all three of them and back to working hard. You just got to be willing to go out and grind every day, I guess. <laughs> Let's see if we can get 10 thumbs up on this YouTube video. Don't forget to subscribe. And our Instagram link is in the description. If you are not following us, go follow our Instagram.